what up YouTube got this package uh, a few weeks ago haven't had a chance to open it or anything but uh let's do it now because I'm about to get it installed Pen card invoice. Got some stickers up in here. Nice. It's a uh, 200 amp. Thought about getting it externally regulated, but this will do for now. Probably won't change it or anything. But yeah, man, I'm about to get it installed in the, the XB. Or at least try to. And uh, we'll see how it goes then. I don't have a vote mail or anything, so. You have to guess on voltage and shit. I'm gonna get this installed and now uh, go off from there. Alright, so I got the old alternator out. Pretty old. I believe it's a 90 amp. Uh, so this 200 amp should be a major improvement uh, first off big difference is the pulley you see how big this one is compared to case versus that it's a lot smaller but yeah it came out pretty simple uh, the bottom bolt was a little hard but you know it came out eventually but yeah you get this installed and uh, we'll see how it goes from there Alright, so everything's installed. Uh, the alternator, that is. Also, have one of these. Um, the AP Mini. I got another one. Temporary setup. My batteries, my four channel. Obviously, that's for these. I got these uh, Soundstream T412s from my cousin. I was over at his house who was working on my uh, putting an alternator in. And he has some of these laying around, so he let me use them for now. Um, they are for sale. Cool. Probably looking like 150 each, plus shipping or whatever. We can work something out. I think they're they're dual one, dual ones, but they each coil reads 1.4. I just got them off the meter, just measured the ohm loads. Uh, but yeah, man, 900 RMS, three inch coils. Pretty heavy, pretty nice. Probably take more than 900 with a three inch coil, but pretty good condition. He hasn't abused them at all. I mean, they've been sitting for a few years now and he only had them off like 900 watts for the pair. So that's like, you know, 450 each. If that, you know, voltage drop and all that good stuff. But yeah, I'm gonna be running this for a little while. Prefab, uh, I don't even know what it's tuned to. Probably like mm, low 40s, <laughs> high 30s. You know, it's a little high for me, but it's good for now until I can get uh, my other stuff. But yeah, about to wire this up. I don't have a voltmeter, so I can't test how the battery is charging or what the, the, the drop is, but I think with a 200 uh, amp alternator and two big ass 104 uh, amp hour batteries should be good. 
Oh yeah, and by the way, uh, there's two more right there too. But we'll see how that goes. Stay tuned for more updates. Peace.